Hey Amorfe, this is Fotsia Zinkolau and in this series of videos we are discussing why men over 30 who have been training for a while and really are careful with their diets, they still don't look great naked, aka they still don't look great when they take their shirts off, okay? So the third reason is that they might be too fat, they might have a ton of body fat to lose, okay? And who knows, maybe this is you. And I really don't care if you think that was politically incorrect so yeah I mean, bear with me i'm just trying to help you look great naked okay so the main problem with having a ton of body fat or a good amount of body fat to lose even though you are careful with your diet is that you lack something that i call caloric awareness and let me give you a very good example with this now, as you may know, or as you may not know, I am Greek and I live in Greece, hence my name and my ex. Okay, so, and here in Greece, we are very uh, famous for our olive oil. Okay, we have great olive oils, we have great tasting olive oils, and they have been part of our culture for decades and even centuries, our grandparents and our great-grandparents who lived through some wars actually survived on olive oil and bad quality bread and tomatoes. So yeah, I mean, it's part of our culture. So, and as you probably know, olive oil is one of the healthiest oils that you can ever consume. So it's a very good quality food. But the damn thing is also very caloric heavy. So one tablespoon of olive oil is like 120 calories. Now, most Greeks here know that olive oil is healthy, but they're not familiar with the caloric part. So if they're preparing a salad for them, they might add like, I don't know, three, four, five tablespoons of olive oil. And that's a lot. I mean, five tablespoons are going to set you back 600 calories. And if you're over 30 and you're a busy professional, then, I mean, that's like, it might be, who knows, maybe it might be one fourth of your daily calories. Okay, that's going to be a lot. Okay, you just wasted your one fourth of your daily calories on olive oil. That's bad. Okay, or they might cook a lot with olive oil and they might not be aware of how much they're actually using when they are preparing the food so by not being aware how caloric heavy olive oil is this holds them back in their weight loss in their fat loss journal and that's very 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 bad because there's nothing 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 that can make a body look really 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 nice especially if you have been training for a while than losing some fat, some, than losing some body fat. I mean, guys who have been training for one, two, three years, and they have some decent muscle in them, but they still like look watery and puffy, then they really, really transform their bodies when they lose like five or ten pounds of fat. Why? Because by losing fat, you actually your body actually looks better. Okay, your muscles. Uh, are defined you can maybe even see some veins popping in your shoulders and your arms or even your calves and your legs so you really really look great when you take that shirt off so that's a very big problem most guys over 30 face okay now one of the best ways to actually battle this is to gain this caloric awareness thing that i'm talking about and depending on your level it might be as simple as measuring uh, as not measuring as noting down what you've been eating three days in a row and then searching online for the caloric content even if you have done this in the past and now you are just eyeballing what you're eating i would still suggest that you take some time to redo this exercise because what i have found especially with my own clients is that i help them understand the caloric value of things when we're getting started they will lose some body fat i will tell them hey you know what now that you are on a ro on a roll yeah you don't really have to count calories and macros and weigh food and shit like that and after a while they might stagnate and 
what the reason why this happens is that they stop counting calories they began eyeballing things and you know what the tendons get there it's very easy for you to make mistakes when you're eyeballing things so by having them recalculate well not recalculate but when i have them weigh again how much they're eating and have them recalculate the calories we discovered that hey you know what they have been overeating so we by recalculating how much they have been eating we are able to lower calories to the point that we want and the weight their fat loss is going to start again okay Omerfet? so please again if you have been following quote unquote a healthy diet for a while and you still have and you're still not proud of your body and you're still maybe look a little bit watery and puffy then make sure that you're not messing your efforts by eating too much by not having this caloric awareness thing that i talked in this video okay so that's all i have to say talk to you soon